to enable Windows Defender in your Windows 11. So hey guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can enable the Microsoft Defender for your Windows 11 computer. So if you're currently encountering any issues, especially related to viruses and other malware, then this video is for you. In this video, I will show you how you can enable the Windows Defender. So in order to proceed, the first thing you need to do is head on to the settings of your Windows computer. To head on to the settings, simply place your cursor towards the bottom of your screen. And once the taskbar opens up, right click onto the start button. Once you will do this, you can see this option of settings. So simply click onto the settings button and you will be landed onto this particular interface. Now from here, you need to choose the privacy and security tab on the left. Then under the privacy and security tab, you can see the first option under the security which says Windows security. So simply click onto the Windows security and you will be landed onto this page. Now here you can see that the virus and threat protection is currently disabled as represented by this cross icon just below this shield symbol. So that means our current virus and threat protection is disabled. So let us see how to enable this. To enable this, you need to click onto this open Windows security button at the top. Once you will do this, it will open the Windows security menu. Now under the Windows security application, you need to click onto this virus and threat protection tab on the left. Once you will do this, you will see this interface. Now from here you also have this quick scan button using which you can actively search for viruses or other malware. And then if you scroll down you can see the virus and threat protection settings under which with a blue link it says manage settings. So simply click onto the manage settings and here you can see that this is the real time protection. If this real time protection is off then you can enable it by clicking onto this toggle and it will be turned on. And then your Windows security application will take in charge and will try to eliminate and prevent any viruses or malware in most of the cases. So that was all for this video on how to open or enable the Windows Defender security. And if this video was any helpful to you, do consider giving it a like. Tell us in the comment how it went for you or if you have any suggestions or questions to ask and also don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel for more such exciting and knowledgeable content. Thanks for watching and have a nice day.